Let's start to introduce electrical and transformer training equipment. This is the power part of the device. Optional direct output of 380 volt power supply and 24 volt power supply. The button here can choose to output power directly. This is the measurement part of the device. There are some voltmeters and AM meters. This is the control part of the DC motor. This is the selection button and low part of the device. The part is the start and the soft start of the motor, and motor output three-phase inverter. This part is connected transformer and the button. This part is adjustable resistance. This is the motor unit part of the device. It can display the motor speed, magnetic powder brake of the motor unit. This is a general introduction to the equipment. Use of motor and transformer equipment. To do DC motor power generation experiment, look at the speed and output voltage of the field winding. Does any changes make any difference? At this time, the DC motor will not generate electricity. We need to adjust the DC motor armature voltage. The armature voltage of the DC motor is around 170 volt. Three-phase synchronous motor speed is about 1,200 rom per minute. DC motor generating voltage is about 100 volt. The current is 0.17 AM. The magnetic powder brake can also be used to control the motor speed. Control voltage by increasing magnetic powder speed. Motor speed decreases. Decrease DC motor voltage. Then restore the magnet powder brake to stop braking. The armature voltage of DC motor is lowered. It. You will see that the emitted voltage will also decrease.
this is the content of the experiment.